All right, guys, we're here today, Bonner Harvest. We're in my cafe, uh, Joe and Willie's Depot. Um, it's getting a little bit colder here in Bondi, so we're gonna do a bit of a more manly winter warmer dish. Uh, we've got ourselves a beef pie, so it's beef, beef and beer pie. So uh, obviously we're closed today. All right, so our first step to our beer and beef pie is to dice our beef up. So personally, I like it nice and chunky. About uh, 300 grams of chuck or cube rolls, great. Now we're just gonna color it in a pot or a pan. So a warm pan, a little dollop of olive oil. The more color you get in here, the more flavor. See that color? It's a seared, beautiful, all those juices are sealed in. That's all sealed off and ready to go. So once you've sealed it off, take it out and just throw it into a separate bowl. Not cooked all the way through, just so it's sealed. So all this sort of sticky stuff on the bottom of the pan, that's all flavor, so keep that on there. Celery, carrot, onion, just throw them straight into the pot. There's also a few bay leaves in the pot. I'm gonna add two cloves of garlic, chili, about two teaspoons of chili in there. So we're just gonna cook this veg down until it's uh, translucent and really soft. All right, so the veg is soft. Grab your beef, throw them back in the pot. Half a beer in there. And then half of me. So we're just cooking some of the alcohol out of the beer and just reducing it down by about one third. So we've got about 400 mils of beef stock in here. So again, we're gonna reduce this by about one third. Uh, so next step is we're gonna thicken this up. Two tablespoons of corn flour. So we're just gonna add a little bit of water to the corn flour to make it a paste so that when we add it to our pie mix, it sort of all goes with it evenly without any chunks. A little bit at a time, it'll thicken up really quick. Alrighty, so let's check this out. Pie mix, straight in there. All right, so, puff pastry. Cut it into shape. You know, if you want, just make a nice little fold of design around the corner. Simple egg wash, just sort of whisk your egg up. So just pop it in your oven. Oven's on 180, 185. It's gonna take about 20 minutes. Um, so basically you're just cooking the puff pastry. Let's have a look. It's exactly what you're after, that golden crust over the pastry. Thanks for watching guys. I'm gonna drink my beer, eat my pie. Make sure you subscribe and uh, yeah, we'll see you next week.